Hey guys, what's up? This is Rendrum1 with another tutorial, and today I'm going to show you how to change your icon of any icon on your desktop. As you can see, I've already changed my Google Chrome icon, so you just want to open up your internet browser. Okay, so now I'm going to leave a link in the description to this page, gimp.org uh, slash downloads slash and what you want to do once you get to this page is you're going to select whatever language you are and then it'll download this small file onto your computer and it's this program that I've used to change the icon <coughs> so once you have that downloaded you want to get to a picture that you like like from Google Images I've already picked out this little picture for my notepad uh, I want to change my notepad one, so you just save image as documents, pictures, uh, just save that. Okay, so once that's done, once you have the, the uh, GIMP and a picture, you just open up GIMP. Okay, so once you have GIMP open, you're going to want to click File and Open. Make sure you're on wherever you saved it to, and you got to look for that picture that you saved. Okay, so here it is. Open it. Okay, so once you're here, you're gonna click on edit. I mean, uh, no, you're gonna click on later. You're gonna go down to transparency and go over and click add alpha channel. Once you click on that, you're gonna go to uh, this little toolbox thing that opens up with the program. And you're gonna click on the fuzzy select tool. Click on that and then click on the background part of the picture so click on it and it should have like outlined your picture uh, and separated the background so make sure you have the background selected and you need to go to edit and go to clear once you click clear you should get this little uh, black and gray this grayish grid around the picture so that's good and you need to click file save as and whenever you get to this little screen, if it says J T uh, G or any other type of picture, you need to replace that with I C O, which is the uh, which is for icon. <coughs> save it, and then click save again. So once that's saved, you can X out of the uh, you can X out of GIMP. Right click on whatever you want to change. Click on properties. And you should see this down at the bottom. Sometimes it'll look different for whichever program you're wanting to change. And you click change icon. Once you get to this, you click browse. Make sure you go to documents, pictures. And you should be able to go down and see the notepad icon. Uh, so yeah, you open that. Click OK. And apply. Now it changed. So, yeah, there you go. Um, please comment, rate, and subscribe if this uh, if this helped you. And subscribe if you want more videos like this. Uh, thanks. Bye.